Grace is a word, a noun, with four letters. It may just be a word, but it affects billions of people worldwide. It impacts me too. This is just my perspective, but sometimes I feel misunderstood as an Indian American athlete. I feel like we're being judged and excluded at times. Others don't think we're like them. It's like we're different species, but we're just like them. People just don't know who I am. Race can be a complicated issue for all humans. What is race? Why are they be- people being excluded for the color of their skin? Why are people being ignored because they of what, what they, they are? They're, it's just that they're the different race. It's not that much different. This person is higher than this person. Is that really like a gender or a color? It's more like, like the crayon's black and white. You don't take a crayon out and throw it away just because it's a different color, right? Many people struggle facing the wrath of the single story. These people could be forever scarred by false stereotypes that judge them. These might even be incomplete stereotypes. When you're young and growing up, you sometimes don't know if your words or actions will hurt someone. This is because the concept of stereotyping and discriminating is still very new to the young communities everywhere. That's why it's important we express our true selves through story. Like Chimamanda said, if you show people as one thing over and over again, that is what they become. But when stories are used the right way, they can empower and humanize. That's why telling my story is so important. I just don't want people to think I'm not like them. I'm a human. We all are. What's so beautiful about all humans is that we all have love and compassion within us. It's the incomplete stories that divide us. I hope we can inspire each other, not to divide, but to unite. Now let us sum it up with Mr. C's work. Grew up in a very small, close-knit community in Maine, predominantly white people, and I hadn't had the opportunity to meet new people and experience new things, so I had this very narrow view of the world. I got the opportunity to teach in the Virgin Islands, and that really opened my eyes to this whole new world and this whole new way of thinking. And that's why I feel like it's even more important for us to explore others and for others to hear your stories. The more we know about each other and and the people around us, this allows us to break down those invisible walls that are there for no reason. You're trying to say we're all humans, we're all loving beings, and we just took the time to just understand each other a little more.